Steph Curry shoots from 30 feet, compared to shooting at the three-point arc, the lateral margin of error shrinks by about 21%. In fact, at that distance, if his release is off left or right by just an eighth of an inch, about the thickness of a car key, he misses the center of the hoop by nearly a foot. In all else being equal, at 30 feet, Curry needs to launch the ball about 16% faster than when shooting at the arc. Now compared to a mid-range shot, to generate more power from long range, the typical NBA player will increase knee flexion at push-off by about 25 degrees. While this increases power, it can interfere with the shooter's timing and form and actually add larger variance to the ball's launch speed. And release velocity accounts for about 65% of all shooting errors. Curry, however, regardless of where he shoots, consistently angles his legs at 115 degrees. He varies the ball's launch velocity primarily by using power he generates through his forearm and wrist, which flicks at about 3,000 degrees per second. This allows him to keep his long distance release compact and repeatable. In fact, our analysis reveals that on threes he's made from 30 plus feet this season, his release time has varied by less than three hundredths of a second. This season, Steph Curry has used that lethal release to make more threes past 30 feet than every other team. In fact, no other player in the league has more than one. For ESPN Sports Science, I'm John Brinkus.